welcome back you guys let's get into this full body at home workout right now i'm just warming up my body with some body weight curtsy lunges i'm also going to be increasing my speed after about 10 or 15 reps from there i'm going to do some push-ups i have to do push-ups they are a great way to warm up the body especially the upper body and i like to do lower and upper body to get blood flowing everywhere Making sure my heart rate is up, I'm doing some jump squats. I'm making sure that my legs are hip distance apart. I'm going deep and I'm squeezing my glutes at the very top. Squeeze those glutes. I'm gonna grab my kettlebell and go into kettlebell swings. My feet are going to be a little past hip distance apart, feet facing outward. Bring that thing all the way up. Pulsing. A squat is killer so at the end of my set I'm doing some pulses as you can tell they're killer and then coming up and squeezing now we're moving on to upper body I'm doing some shoulder presses making sure to get in each arm doing about 10 reps here bicep curls are next I wanted to just get a 90 degree angle and then squeeze at the very top. It's not a race. Take your time and do about 10 reps. Moving on to more chest work, I'm doing push-ups again, but this time I'm elevating my legs. You can use a chair or a couch. Now I'm going to go on to kickbacks. I love kickbacks. They're a great booty exercise. Making sure my back is in a nice tabletop position, I'm pushing my leg up and squeezing my glutes at the top. Not into boring workouts, so try to turn on some music, make this workout as fun as possible, and think super positive. You got this. Moving on to ab exercises, I'm keeping my hips as still as possible and doing alternating touches on the kettlebell. More leg exercises. This is a great balancing one. It's a curtsy style lunge, but definitely harder, so make sure you have a wall next to you and do alternating taps on each leg. Want to keep the heart rate up, so I'm going to do jumping jacks. I'm also going to move on to high knees. Anything that's going to keep your heart rate up and get that sweat on is so important when you're doing an at-home workout. I'm doing a little jump roping. Seriously, get creative here. Do dancing, whatever you can to do cardio for about two minutes. Last little bit of squats. We're doing a squat to shoulder press. I kept my legs more than hip distance apart and feet facing out ending this exercise in a pulse of course for about 10 reps and then holding for about 10 seconds killer then we're moving on to a tricep exercise try to keep your arm as closest to your ear as possible at a 90 degree angle and squeeze your tricep at the very top each arm is for about 12 reps chest press is next i'm also going to be adding a hip thrust so when i go up with my chest press i'm also squeezing my glutes into a hip thrust do this for about 12 15 reps now to solely focus on the chest press i'm doing alternating chest press i'm just raising the kettlebell over my chest and squeezing mind muscle connection here now in an active lunge position, I'm going to be really working my back here. One arm at a time, I'm going to be pulling the kettlebell up and squeezing my back. Really, once again, think about the muscle that you are working here. And this is a great way to get in a nice back exercise. Of course, make sure you're doing each arm for about 10 reps. Take your time here. And as you switch arms, make sure you switch legs as well. Now we're moving on to our ab series. Doing a simple crunch here with my legs high in the sky and my arms completely out, just focusing on raising my chest and squeezing my abs. Now I'm gonna hover one foot down, barely touching the floor and one leg up, doesn't really matter how straight it is, and I'm trying to touch my toes. Moving into a boat pose, I'm gonna be alternating on each side to really get that oblique twist once again, squeezing the muscle, ending here in a little alternating leg movement over the kettlebell, focusing on my abs, squeezing, squeezing, squeezing. That was rough, you guys. I was dripping in sweat and could not wait to eat a huge meal and do some stretching. So thank you guys so much for watching. I can't wait to hang out again.